Hey family, it's your girl Chef Evelyn here and I know it's been a long time since you've seen me doing a video exclusively for this channel and that is because I have been kind of doing a little bit of everything. If you follow me on social media, on Snapchat, on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, on Periscope, then you know I've been going through a lot of changes personally um, and then also professionally. So I started um, a video years ago um, that said how to be a freelance chef and it's funny because I've done so much more freelance chef work since then that I really wanted to do in a video for anybody that's new to the culinary world, new to the hospitality industry, thought about going to culinary school, is curious about being a chef, but doesn't necessarily want to go work in a restaurant or a hotel or on a cruise ship like in the traditional form, which I've been a chef and I have I did not work in those places. I was a career changer. I was a little bit older. I was like, I don't want to spend 90 hours a week in a hotel. Like, I'm just not about that life. So I'm coming back because what I really want to do is I want to revisit that. That's probably one of the most popular videos on my channel. I get a lot of emails about it. I get a lot of private messages and different things on social media about it. And I wanted to do a free, 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 free live workshop on being a freelance chef. So I'm going to have this video up. The live workshop um, will be on October, it's a Monday, I believe it's the 10th, Monday, October the 10th, and I'll leave a link to sign up for the um, free workshop there. It's gonna be live, you'll be able to ask your questions, but I'm gonna kinda take you through uh, several ways to be a freelance chef without working in, uh, and, and without catering either, because believe it or not, guys, I'm just not a huge fan of catering, like, I. I don't like to cater when I say that. Like, I, there are some amazing caterers out there. I totally understand the need for caterers. I will hire caterers when I need to use them, but that's not my thing, right? And so a lot of times you're like, man, I have this love for food. I have this, I, you know, I want to share it. I want to be in the culinary world. Cooking or baking makes me so happy, but I don't necessarily want to own a restaurant or work in a restaurant or a hotel or be a caterer, right? Um, So I'm going to be sharing some kind of, some well-known ways that you can be in the food service industry and in the culinary industry as a chef um and then some ways that a lot of people are not familiar with and so um like i said i'm going to leave the link below i know it's kind of random me coming on but uh i've gotten a lot of requests for this recently particularly since i told people i left my job at the gourmet retailer so i wanted to have a place where we could all come together and um talk about it together okay so let me know below what your questions are right like do you have questions about should you go to culinary school have you did you go to culinary school should you not you have like leave any questions you have about wanting to be a chef wanting to be a freelance chef if you're already a chef wanting to get your nights weekends and holidays back because i don't work most nights weekends and holidays anymore so talk to me about that i'm going to share how i've been able to travel as a chef and get paid well okay like what I used to make in a week I was making in two hours right so we're going to talk about all of that and um so let me know like I said it's going to be on Monday October the 10th and the reason why it's going to be on a Monday is because if you're already in the food service industry that's usually your slowest day of the week um there will be a replay available if you can't make it but it's probably only going to be for like 24 or 48 hours because I really want it to be a live experience where you can get your questions answered live so please leave your questions and anything that you've ever wanted to know about what I do about what you would like to do information that you would like to know and be included in this workshop below like I said it's free 99 please share this video with anybody you know who is in culinary school who just started culinary school who's thinking about it anyone who's a chef is like I need to do something different I need to get off the grind I can't work all these hours you let me know and uh tag them in this video tweet them post it on social media and send them the link to register right so um the freelance chef 
free workshop. It's just the easiest way for me to get it all there in there. Please leave your questions and thoughts below. And I will see you guys hopefully before October the 10th uh, on this channel. But I, if not, um, you know I'm always on Periscope and Snapchat and Instagram and Facebook. So you need to follow me there because I'll be cooking live and all this kind of stuff. Particularly on Periscope and Snapchat and Insta Stories. And then um, I will see you guys in the workshop. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.